Okay, Northern Forest. Here we are. Now, I do have a very specific place in mind. So, we are going to head that direction. We got the Xeno Zapper ready. Um, I'm not 100% sure where we are, but I know the general area. Yeah, we're getting a little jumpy. Hopefully, my encoders all figure stuff out. I was messing with this for a good 20, 30 minutes before the stream trying to nail it down. It's definitely better than it was, but I am sure that I have plenty of settings to go and help it. So yeah, like I said, I have a lot of things planned for this uh, for this save. Um, one of the things, one of the important things, ooh, we need to be picking up grass along the way. That's what we need to be doing. Oh, one little trick, if you didn't know, which I didn't find out till way later, is if you hold, if you go over uh, some grass and you hold, um, it will auto pick up. Now you can't just hold the button You've got to be selecting the grass on the first one, and then it will continue to to pick up. Yeah, we're still getting some coding funkiness going on. Ooh, we got some fun stuff over here. This isn't exactly where I want to be yet. The grass is really causing uh, some problems, so luckily the majority of this stream will be me not out here picking up grass uh, if you're familiar with the start area I am going to where everybody starts the the speed running start that's where I'm headed because in a way I I really am gonna be doing a speed run with this um, yeah that looks very, very populated down there. Um, I'm not going to be building really any permanent factories until I get the fast belts. Uh, my last playthrough, I just got really tired of rebuilding stuff when I would get a faster belt or having to way over engineer because my um, belts weren't as fast as they could be. That's nice. Yep, here's where we're starting. Seems to emit unfamiliar energy readings, which could potentially be retrofitted into Fixit technology. A new research tree can now be accessed in the MAM. New research tree. We don't even have our MAM. All right, this is where we're going to be starting. So I have to do a little bit of uh, infestation clearing first. There's probably at least one more hog, and where'd he go? There he is. And I'm sure there's some hives. Come on. Go. The remains of this creature might shed light on how to increase chances of survival. A new research tree can now be accessed in the MAM. I thought there was some bugs over here. Apparently not. I'll take it. All right, this is our going to be our new home for a while. Okay. Temporary hub right here. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to actually, let's see if I can increase. So I do have Lumen on, and it's creating a little bit of some dark issues here. Um, let's try brighten her up just a bit. That's a little better. 
still a little on the dark side. But uh, we'll uh, we'll play with this for a while and see how we like it. Okay, hub time. Hub. Ab. Good enough for now. There he is. Pretty cool. Crashed him into the cliff there, but he'll live. All right. So, exciting times. I've been um, holding off on really playing any satisfactory at all for update eight and this um, series to start. So I've been really dying. I did a little bit of testing here and there, but been really dying to play for a while. Mm, let's see. Power. Some biomass burners up. Oh, that's all we get. Can I make a some? It's been so long since I've started a fresh save. I can't remember. All right, so we can definitely definitely need to start with some biomass. Should be good enough to get us started. What else we short? Wire? We can make some wire, can we? Probably not, actually. There's copper around the corner, so we'll go uh, deal with that soon. Let's get this going. And then definitely need... As soon as I get some foundations, I'm basically going to be redoing this, so I'm not too worried about what this looks like. Let's set this to leaves, and let's dump all of our leaves. And let's get the box for it to fit in. No viewers yet. I'll have to, uh, you know, you got to start from somewhere. Um, you, you can also definitely use these back here, but I just, I don't know. They, uh, moving. Oh, it's so slow. Okay. I just don't use them for so long. I don't use them for long enough to really make it worth it. What I really need is to get some copper going and... Some go with two. Can we afford two? We can. So we'll go rods with this one. Nope. I forgot. We need smelt first, dummy. We're just throwing some stuff up here real fast to uh, get things moving. And iron ingots. 
What are we shortest on? You're shortest on... That bad boy. Yep. Don't even have rods to build a second one. Um, can do a little bit of cheating. If I had some wire... Alright, we really gotta get the wire going. Copper, which should be right here. Do we have any friends nearby? I think we're safe. missing wire so can't build a smelter I don't have the wire that's okay do some hand crafting not too bad even definitely need this oh yeah iron rods <laughs> let's go pick up what we got and a viewer my first viewer got to reconnect that hello first viewer you have the distinction of being my first viewer. So thank you. Thank you for joining me. Good place to stash this up out of the way. That'll work. And my first viewer is gone. Well, he didn't count because he didn't say anything. Oh, he's back. Or a different someone's back. Hello, first viewer. Oh, I got a like. First viewer, first like. I'll take it. This is my first live stream, and I'm restarting a save on update eight. And I started, oh, about 15 minutes ago. So we we're literally right out the gate. I'm also gonna be making videos from these, so. Oh, of course. It starts. The first of many power fuse breaks. Ooh, get that later. Now, did we run out or did we... No, we didn't run out. We just need another one.
So welcome, first viewer. Are you somebody that I know, or are you a uh, a new friend? Oh, it's not gonna like this. Go. This. I have. Oh, I do. Nice, and... Come on, come on. Nice, so we're looking good. I believe I have the chat open, so... If you're saying anything, I should be able to see it in chat. I don't know if it's possible to look and see the... Um, like I said, I'm pretty new to this, so I don't know if it's possible to see if... See what the names are, you know? Uh, I got some iron ore. I know what I was gonna do. Like, see who's watching the stream without them talking. I don't know if that's possible. Build it over here. Really? Uh, it's gonna be a mess, oh well. There. 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 I guess we're gonna have to do here. Come on. Oh, cable. It's always tough starting out. I'm uh, so used to. Let's see which ones are the most important ones. Let's cut this one. You do that one, actually. <laughs> All right, let's go get the copper that I know that we've mined. And we'll make some cable, and we'll build the power line that we need. There we go. <laughs> it's a mess. I am so out of everything. At least we got some iron rods. Cable. We need to connect this one and this one. Okay. We're up and running. Now what I wanted, what I've been trying to do is drop this extra stuff in here. Feed. Can't, don't have any iron plates. Pick these off. Come on, come on, come on. Alright. Give me some iron plates. Still don't have enough. <laughs> I'm like building on a budget here, which I'm not very good at. The plan is very many mega factories. Actually, not that many, because they're gonna be pretty large. Not enough. There we go. Okay, come on now. There we go. Now there should be a bunch of, yeah, iron ore build up there. So I will be the belt for now. Set that up. Okay.
You're moving. Okay. <sighs> How's our power doing? Um, we're doing okay, I think. Yeah, capacity 60. Our max is 38, so... Got a little room, a little overhead, not a lot. <laughs> Put that in there. Okay, cool. So, basic setup here. We have one iron node working. We don't have any splitters yet, so this is producing a lot more than the belt can remove. So we're gonna be, actually we could, we're gonna have leftovers, which is kind of cool. We don't really have the power to power more buildings yet, but uh, I kind of went to, like, the starting place, the speedrunning starting place. Everything around here is really, really good. There's a lot of nodes, and they're very high quality. You get a lot out of them. See, there's a bunch more iron over here for our needs later. Refilling our, our grass. And right here is where we're making our power needs. Grass. Grass gets turned into biofuel here. Pick up the biofuel. Can we afford another one of these? Nope. We need iron and iron plates and copper. So let's go ahead and go get, see what our copper's doing. Unfortunately, we also need to set up Oh yeah, irons or uh, copper's looking good. We need to set up some cable. So, again, lacking splitters really sucks. But I think we should be able to do the same trick. Squeeze you in there. That'll work. Have room on this. And then. Reinforced iron plates. Yikes. There's a limit to the constructors we can build. With the reinforced iron plates they give us at the start. And reinforced iron plates aren't, you know, not too terrible, but you actually have to... Concentrate a little when you make them. So, again, there's some, like, artifacty things, because I have, I think I have some settings turned down in order to really stream clearly. Um, I think it's update 8. I think, yeah, that's a little funky. Little, little bits of weirdness there. I'm not sure what's going on with that, but it is experimental, so I'm okay with it. Oh, can we even make reinforced plates? No, we can't even make... Oh, yeah, we can. I'm blind. Screws. Make some screws. Let's make four. Kind of all... Oh, I, I lied. We're going to make six, I guess. Uh, kind of all stressy because I wanted to start this at nine, and I went to check and make sure everything was working 30 minutes beforehand, and didn't realize that the experimental build was going to reset all my in-game settings that I had like perfectly tuned to have a nice clean stream. Just need some cable. As long as we can build a craft bench, we can. Here, let's empty our... Come on. Get him moving. And what else was I gonna do? I was gonna grab this. Come on. Grab this. But yeah, uh, all my settings weren't there. And then of course, there's a bunch of new settings because it's update eight. And 
because it's a brand new engine. I don't know what settings are doing what necessarily. It was kind of a mess. I was frantically like trying to get the encoding to go nice and smoothly and um, you know, mostly a success. It's a little jumpy in the grass. Hello, second viewer. Hi, I'm French Canadian. I'm understanding, but for writing is a little complicated for me. Okay, that's all. That's cool, French Canadian. This is uh, so. If you don't know, it in the upper left hand corner of my screen, experimental build update eight for satisfactory. So uh, it's a brand new save that we're starting. And uh, I'm like 20 minutes in. And uh, this is the, my first live stream, like ever. So, oh, we don't want this. Do we? Do we? Do we? Do we? Do we? No, we want cables. So, all right, I had a brain fart. I was talking, not paying attention. We want this, I think. So we're gonna go into wire gonna be copper we need some more power uh, this is my second playthrough um, I didn't quite finish the first like all the elevator parts on my first playthrough pretty close and this cable now our power should be really close there yeah a little bit but we're okay now for now copper ingots okay oh yeah we're uh we're gonna cheat here we're gonna take the extra copper ingots i'm gonna feed these in by hand so we can get some cable going because <sighs> i really need splitters oh my gosh i forgot concrete i can't believe it i'm worried about copper okay we're gonna feed this again by hand but yeah uh i have a lot of uh I'm kind of repeating myself here for my second viewer which i'm super excited about thank you um i have a lot of big plans for this save i've been planning it for months waiting for update 8 to come out um and if you've been following along you know that um it was delayed update 8 was let's go ahead and get a third one online here and so i kind of had extra time to plan Uh, and I'm going to be making some mega factories, um, really pushing the limits. I have Lumen turned on, by the way. That's why things are a little bit different. Um, but I'm going to try to make my factories with Lumen in mind. So lots of windows, tons of lights. Um, I think you have to have them. I happen to know there's concrete up on that ridge. Um, and that's a long drop and I don't really have any ways of getting back up here. So I have to be careful So uh, anyway, I'm gonna have a theme for the whole build Which I'm really looking forward to uh, it's actually gonna be I'm gonna make everything um, the Empire from Star Wars So I'm gonna build a Super Star Destroyer. I'm gonna build a Death Star I'm going to build the Imperial Palace uh, from Star Wars. Uh, all of my buildings are going to have that theme. So I'm really, really looking forward to challenging myself and doing some new stuff. Um, we need a constructor. Good thing we accidentally built six um, reinforced iron plates. Needed them. And we're going to go... Oh, no! What am I doing? Talking too much. That's a new thing for me to kind of chatting while I play this game. I'm gonna have to get used to that. Okay, hey, that's set up. How's our power? Our power looks great. Are we going? We're going. And yeah, we're just gonna we're just gonna we're just gonna do it until we really get 
um, are beginning um, sort of basics done, foundations, splitters, that kind of thing. Um, I'm I'm going to be making quite a bit of. Uh, we're going to be doing a lot of spaghetti, so it's just how it has to be. But I usually don't. It, it irritates me a little bit making the factories with kind of this little amount of organization. Okay, uh, we're still feeding grass. We are, we're looking good. We need a cement box. There we go, concrete is cooking. Yeah. Let's go and feed our second smelter here. Pick up our extra copper. All right, looking good. Now the goal here, if you're new to Satisfactory, is that milestone. 200 concrete, 100 each of the metals. But we do we have enough to at least put some in here? Yeah, we have all the we have all of those, so that's nice. Um, let's get rid of some of our extra stuff. We don't need the slug. Um, hold on to that. We don't need that. We're not going to use flower petals. So yeah, that looks good. Um, all right. So honestly, we, for now we kind of have to wait for some things to build. So what I'm gonna do is get some of this, uh, get some more grass for feeding me power. The first real goal that we're pushing towards, we won't get there tonight, um, is coal power because then power is automated and I don't have to go gather shit like this. One trick uh, is if you, instead of spamming the button, E, if you hold it well, as you grab something, then you can run and it'll just pick stuff up. So I'm mostly picking up leaves, a little bit of wood, and some flower petals. We'll use the leaves and the wood for power. The flower petals, though, are used for paint later. But we'll save them. Bird. But I appreciate you guys being my first two viewers. A little bit more of this. It's super boring, but unfortunately it has to be done at the beginning of this game. The more we do now, the less we'll have to do later. Getting pretty though, look at that. Really nice. And all my key bindings are off too from my my old say or from my other game because this is experimental, so it's like a new settings file. Yeah, we're getting uh, sun's going down. I think. Maybe it's coming up, I don't know. It's probably coming up. All right. All right, that's a lot of grass. That will hold us off for a long time. Good. Definitely ready for some more ore. Yep. 
And how's our concrete doing? This is going to be the slow. Yeah, unfortunately, I needed to get that started first, and I kind of forgot. Or Ooh, one thing we can do, we're gonna need um, quite a bit of animal protein. So why don't we head this way? Because I know there's some hogs down here. Kill ourselves some local wildlife and use their remains to power our. Okay, here we go. Also, some um, random parts. Come here, come here, buddy. Come on. Oh, there's two of you. Ah. One down. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? There you are. Got ya. All right, so let's raid this thing. Oh, that water looks really nice. That water looks great. Really cool. Should be some more parts. Here is some reinforced plates. 24. Wow, that's that's nice. That saves us a ton of time. Making those by hand. Oh, more of them. 31. I'll take it. That is really nice. That is shockingly good. Okay, what do we need? A modular frame. So, we don't have the map yet. What I like to try to do is on the map, open the, when I see these, um, little weird little artifact there. Yeah, interesting. Like a purple line. There, no. Um, I'll mark this on the map and say what it needs, and in this case, one modular frame. So then... You know, I'll because I'm not gonna remember. There's a ton of them, and we need those hard that hard drive out of there. Um, it gives us the ability to use alternate recipes when making things. Let's kill a couple more hogs, and that should be get us to where we need to go for now. That noise. Like a little, that guy's like a little poison, poison flower thing. But you can blow him up with some bombs that you get later, but I can't kill him now. I swear there's a couple more hogs over here. Oh, found you. I don't mean to build a power pole. Is there three? Nope, just two. There we go. Og remains. Okay. There's a lot uh, of exploring in this game. There's a lot more difficult... Uh, this game isn't really about, like, killing the creatures or whatever. It's just kind of an added thing. But there are some creatures that are pretty tough to kill. At least two birds. It's like, hanging out. <laughs> this game is really awesome. It's super addicting. I honestly had no idea what I was getting into when I started playing this game. Okay, hog remains, flower petals. Good enough for now. We are out of ore here. This going. Um, yeah, actually, you know what I want to do? 
switch these. Because I have plenty of, um, I, have, uh, I need more iron plates than I need. Oh, he's full. Okay, cool. That'll work. Yeah, I need more iron plates than I need, um, iron rods, so I'm good with the switch. This one's set up right, though. The um, regular wire is getting all the love. Oh, yeah, give me that 200 cable. There's another one of those birds. Okay, come on now. 200 concrete. 200 concrete. No. We're short. That wasn't what I wanted at all. Uh, we can help things out a little bit. We have some on us, don't we? Yeah, we have a little bit on us. So why don't we make what we can? And then we'll get to see our... Only 15, which is lame. We'll get to see our first uh, milestone. We're so close. Really short on iron plates, though. There we go. We, we know we weren't. How are we looking here? Not bad. Needs a little TLC. Uh, I actually think we can afford another... We need concrete. It's good enough for now. There we go. So, what's interesting about these bio burners, which is really nice, is they only burn enough fuel that they need to power the um, what's on. So, they'll all do it evenly. So, because I added that, these other ones will slow down. Um, and then they'll slowly ramp up as I add more buildings that need to be constructed. So, you know, I'm not wasting anything. Um, one thing that we definitely can do, though, is build this. Copy of this. Or things are getting a little tight. The wood. So we have one set up for the leaves. The biomass wood. So I can stick all of that in there. And then oh yeah, concrete for the power for the power pole that we need real quick. 38. Is that enough? It is enough. So let me get this finished. Then there we go. He working? He's working. All right, let's launch it, baby. Milestone reached. You have unlocked several structures aimed to provide the first needed to build basic factory infrastructure and improved overview. Building these will provide a grid for more advanced organizing and sectioning of your factory. All right. Sent it up. What's next? Yeah, these splitters. These splitters I need so bad. Now, we can't start filling the pot again until um, he comes back, which will be in a minute and a half. So, let's do our chores really quickly. Come on. There we go.
And let's refill this one. So now what I'm going to start doing is... I probably won't... I'm actually... I'll probably delete the power... Um, generators and the hub. Actually, I may just delete everything, rebuild on the foundations. Because this is driving me insane. If I just do it now, get it out of the way... Here he goes, he's landed. That is super cool. Now, it's nothing compared to the space Mass elevator. Change concluded. Fix it freighter reentry complete. Have enough? Definitely have enough of these. Oh yeah, baby. We're cooking with gas. Milestone reach. Conveyor belts can now merge, split, and lift to increase the complexity and efficiency of your factory. We encourage you to consider more verticality when it comes to factory logistics to streamline short-range transportation. The productivity display will help you measure and improve the productivity of individual buildings to aid with optimization. Here's the uh, heavy modular frames that we need to open up that hard drive that's on the other side of the mountain there. But uh, let's finish off tier one first, field research, because that way we get our map and our MAM. Um, yeah, you know what we can do real quick? Let's just make these screws ahead of time, so they're ready to go. And then we just gotta wait for that bad boy to come back. And we'll get our field research done also. How many do I need? 300, I think? Oh, man. Three minutes. Pod will return in three minutes. 300. And then... What I'm gonna do is... I'm actually just gonna see if I can... Um, save up that 100 real quick. iron plates so before I tear everything down I want to make sure that we have what we need for the next milestone make 20 iron plates oh this handcrafting is like boring horribly boring on purpose so that we don't do it very much when we get our automation going All right, 57, we need 100. All right? Yep. There's not, oh, we're so close. Let's build 20 more. And then I'm gonna delete everything that I've built. Uh, yeah, everything I've built. and uh, put down foundations, and then rebuild it. Oops. This should do it. 97. All right. So we're all ready to go. We'll delete the hub last. Um, yeah, there's nothing for it. Let's just go. Oh, you know what I want to do? Before we get too crazy. Ooh, lookout tower. Nice. Um, build a storage container over here out of the way. And let's put some of this. Our um, storage is going to fill up like crazy. Let's just, let's just actually just store it all. Okay, here we go. 
Oh, he's landing. Perfect. Now, if you didn't know, um, there's no loss of materials when you delete stuff. And if you delete um, anything like this stuff on this belt, when I delete it, it's going to go in my inventory. Now, if my inventory fills up, which is likely to happen. Oh, you know what? <laughs> I forgot. I emptied my inventory and we need that much stuff to uh, launch that. Yeah, see, look at this, all this crap in my inventory. Um, get one of those, have those that we need. We need the screws. Build another one of those, yep. All right, good. Hey, we're, we're moving fast. I'm by no means a speedrunner, but I'm Pretty proud of this. The map has been unlocked. Okay. All goes. The molecular analysis machine referred to as the MAM. The MAM! Indeed, to provide new technologies, items, and buildings based on samples collected in the field. Yep, there's our greater chance of success during exploration and up uh. tool belt has been provided as well as an object scanner and beacons. Note, the object scanner requires calibration via the MAM to enable detection of specific objects. Also, if you hit R you can zoop stuff out like this, so you don't have to build them individually. I just I think we're gonna have a little hill. Yeah, we'll deal with it. If I set the floor to the height of, come on, come on. I set the floor to the height of that, um, Oh, do I have full inventory? Yes. That's what my problem is. Much better. Yeah, if I set the height to my floor so that this hill gets covered over, then it's gonna be too high for... Oh, actually. Oh, that looks crappy. Uh... We do this. Too high. Get rid of these. It's kind of a big deal. I'm never like I gotta set this um, foundation at the right height because I don't want to touch it again. And if it's too high, then the miners won't work. Let's, let's test it. Okay, that'll work. I wasn't really worried about that one. Yeah, that'll work too. Okay. Alright. We're gonna go... We're gonna go this high. So, let's kill these. That gets... Uh, that fixes our... Hill problem. Barely. <laughs> oh, that's so close. But it does. Um, what we really need to get going very quickly is the concrete because I am out. Which means we have to get the power going again. Just very quickly do walls, nice. Bear lift. This guy go in.
Okay. Hopefully I have some more concrete in boxes over here. We're also gonna kill the uh, hub and replace it on foundations. Oh, a little bit of concrete, jeez. Not good. I have to salvage some of this. The reason that I built it out like this is so that there is a world grid, but it gets a little funky with um, height. So I wanted to just make sure if you build these um, these two meter high ones, it should be fine. But I just like to make sure. All right, so. Do it. One, how many do we have? I can't remember. Four. Oh, we can't afford it. Do we have any more iron plates in here? Yeah. All right. One more. Get us up and running. Then get some power in place. Really? Apparently not. And then... Come on. Okay. Fuse broken. I left my, um... There's my fuel in this box. There we go. Next. Need concrete so badly. There it comes. It's way over there. to fix it later. Guess we can steal this. I want to try to get the hub set as well. Oh, I forgot we have the stuff. The hub has a storage that we put some stuff in. Oh my gosh. Throw some stuff on the ground here. We'll come back for you. It's like moving. Real life. Horrifying. Close. All right. Place our hub somewhere nice. That's good. Kind of in the trees there. It's not clipping against the, uh, the cliff. I think this is a good place. Good home for a long time. Alright, now. Some of this concrete I'm dying for. Got to get our metal up and running again quickly. Okay. Oh, the, the ma'am. We're gonna be using that soon. 
Okay, so for now, we're gonna put all of this stuff in our personal storage box. Gotta pick up our leaves here. Kill that. Put this long-term storage stuff away, which is that and that, and the leaves. Okay, all right, I like it, I like it. Don't know really that. And we really gotta get this metal going. There's our splitters. Of course we're missing concrete. It's totally fine. Okay. Good. <laughs> I'm gonna have to kill that. Go. There. There. This. There. And about three smelters. Get on there. Oh, gotta line that up correctly. Shocker, guess what we're out of? That'll hold us off for a little while. So the trick for right angles is two back. So I'll show you, I'll do this again. So I know I want to turn here, right, the green line. So if I go two back and then I take it, then it'll be a right angle. Um, power. Then copper ingots, and you can copy and paste settings. So, oh, copper ingots. All right, we have three smelters for iron working now. Almost like we know what we're doing. Now we are just gonna. Oh, we'll make it tight. Good work. Oh, I lied. Gotta do the middle one first. Come on, baby. Alright, let's make sure this works. Floor is too steep because I need more feet. Good, it works. It wasn't too bendy. And that works. Did I build this backwards or something? The heck. Overlapping clearance. 
So that's a new thing in update eight, this um foot. But I don't want the foot right now. The little um actually builds the stand first. I don't know why it's not connecting like it should. There we go. That was super weird. Some little data quirks. My problem is this is that'll work. All right, and now we're gonna do. Gosh, this is rough. Um, I think we're going to do two iron plates and... Yeah, because we need 30 per minute iron ingots there. That's making 30. We're going to do another iron plate. So that's 30 and 30. And then actually what we're going to do... Yeah, after we get more concrete... is iron rods only need half. I should have made more space. I forgot we were going to be splitting this. Wait, can I cheat? No! Yeah, because this is making 30. And iron rods here only take 15. So this whole thing is... whole thing is off. It's okay, we're gonna fix it. Very, very, very quickly. Got enough room? That's not the right way to fix this mistake. Goes there, it goes back. These are the ones that get, fortunately. I just needed more space. Again, even after all this, it's still very temporary. Is that enough? That should be enough. Uh, we're actually going to build some um, out here and way out there. We're going to build a platform out, out over that canyon. And we're going to build our real starter factory out there. But we have to get this going enough to get enough materials to actually start that. So, splitter. Will you please work? Nope, still didn't build enough space. So much space. <laughs> I don't even care anymore.
Okay, iron rods. Iron rods. We need two. We need one here. What are we gonna do? Ugly. That works. Yeah, I was too little space and then I built too much. It's okay. What are we waiting for here? Power, I think. There goes here. There. 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 And there. These need to be set to iron plates. Copy. Based. Okay. Um, yes. That is good. But our power is running a little bit low. But not as low as our concrete is. Got a fourth one online. We do need to fix that concrete problem. We have a splitter now. So, let's do a little quick math and figure out how many constructors we can keep busy. So we're pulling 120, and we're eating 45, so not quite three, right? Yeah, 120 divided by 45, yeah, 2.6. I'm okay with it. Um, can we afford to, oh my goodness, all right, all I'm gonna, <laughs> all I can do is build this, um, get him the right height, I can't even do that, oh my gosh, all right, check out this long distance collection, when you delete something, the contents go into your inventory. Oh, I didn't have to run down there and run back. We're going to put this on a grid. Um, yep, that works for me. Like right in the middle, too. Is there a little... Oh my gosh, it's... Ugh. You go a little higher. Give it to me a little higher. There. Miner should be able to reach that still. Perfect. Now, we're going to have a little bit of hill issue over there, but at least not right in front of us. And what did we say we were going to do? Three. It's perfect. We have a three-way splitter. Right down the middle. Production. Constructor. Now the nice thing is, oh actually, <laughs> a little bit of a problem, 
These belts are only 60, so... Yes, that will make 120 per minute. Unfortunately, it won't do it yet. Uh, cuz it's limited at this at this belt until we get the 120 belts. there get you working again oh there drilling We're drilling and now we just need some mergers first time we've used mergers and we're missing iron plate I mean because <clears throat> of course we are That was a little scary. But, you should be full of iron plate. Yes. Oh my gosh, we have so many of those. That's crazy. Um, we'll, we'll find something to do with those. All these extra ingots we have in our um, inventory because we, uh, Concrete killing me. This hooked back up. I'll have to rebuild him later. Nice if I actually lined it up. Alright, do I have the guts to um, run up, up it? I do! Ooh. Let's get our mergers going. We haven't fed our uh, copper in forever. Actually don't need a merger over there. Good. There. Boom. 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 Oh, I forgot to turn these to concrete. That would be great. Okay. bugs me. Gotta fix it. Alright, there we go. Need some railing up here. Okay! That's really gonna help our concrete. We have... Oh yeah, we do. We have some extra limestone. We're going to drop all this limestone in here. Where's our ledge? Ooh. Okay. We're moving fast. How long have we been playing? hour and 20 minutes and we are doing really well really really well um okay our copper needs some attention we haven't been over there in forever Good, we don't need to pick that up. Okay, um, yeah. 
Concrete's the problem, of course. Look at how much more concrete's on that belt. It's really nice. I want to get rid of these ingots, so... What do we need more of? Um... You know what we need to do? We need to see what our next milestone is. That's what we need. Card assembly. Okay. Well, we're definitely gonna... Okay, we got a bunch of this already. But... We're low on iron plates, so that's that answers that question. So what we're gonna do? Oh, and I, like a dummy, <sighs> throw my cable in the box. How's our wire doing? Be okay for a little while. I built it backwards. Look okay? <laughs> that looks okay. Oh my goodness, we have we have so much ore. In, uh. Need this power. You're taken. These aren't a little bit of a mess. We really need to do... What do we need? I need to do a central power here. Still pretty messy. And okay, that's better. Um, and then I'm gonna build another one. I'm gonna connect to you, you, you. And then you're gonna make rods because. Oh, and we're backing up. We out of shocker concrete. many storage bins so these two guys are need enough room for the mergers iron rods we're low on iron rods there should be here sir
then merger. Okay, iron plates. And here, we need some iron plates. Iron plates. Steal you from there. Need to be in front of this guy. There's a little green line. Really hard to see. On the left side of the screen, about halfway down. It tells me that it's lined up. Okay, then here's our box for... Did I do that right? Nope. Box for rods. All right, we are um, doing good, moving fast. Now we do have another little project, which I am loath to do, but it has to happen. These actually need to be making screws. So let us make some screws. Here's the green line. Here's the green line. All right. 15 per minute screws take Right, 10 per minute. So, this is this fun little, you know, you could split this in three parts and then remerge two of them to put it in there. Uh, it's ridiculous, I hate it. So, we're not gonna do that. Um, we're just gonna use a splitter. Go in there, and then half will go in there. So it's not going to be perfect, but it'll get us some screws going. Here's our screws. Okay. Now, we really have to deal with power. Oh, these guys here. Uh, what was I going to do? I was going to do some extra iron plates. And those are extra iron rods. Then what I can do is I can dump a bunch of rods in here. Oh, no power. Be nice. Oh. Put my rods back, bro. There we go. And then let's split this again. There. That gives it a bunch of rods. Um, to get started. Um, and then we're gonna use up that. And then we're going to use up this, some of that. All right. Uh-oh. It's not good. Red light. Luckily, we made way more um, biomass than we needed back when, before I destroyed everything. But what we need now we have room back here. Yeah, we have room back here. So, we need to rebuild our production facility for biomass. 
after we get more concrete. Also, I need to take a two minute bio break, but I will be right back. I will not go far. One second. Okay. Ready to rock. This up. How do we want to organize this? I think we want two. All right, we want a little path to walk, first of all. A room. We want two here. And then instructor. Don't need any splitting. Right in there, perfect. Another constructor. I'll show what I'm doing here in a sec. lines are lined up okay so this one is going to be biomass wood this one's going to be biomass leaves we're going to put the leaves in here and we're going to put the wood in here some power go no, didn't have to break it okay so now we have those working now when they come out they're both biomass it's just that this one makes biomass with the leaves, and then this one makes biomass with the wood. So we're gonna merge them. Now they're just biomass. Should be able to jam that up pretty close. Perfect. Perfect. And then Gonna build another one. Oh, uh, we don't have. Where's my solid biofuel? Here. All right. I'm just gonna. Um, we're gonna replace this storage container with another constructor in a few minutes. That will make solid biofuel, and that will last way longer than that biomass. So, looking great. Let's see how many screws we have, and then, to be frank, we are going to have to... Unfortunately, just oh, two forty. We're halfway there. 
make sure we have plenty of rods. We're going to have to crank out the rest of these by hand. Screws are the worst in this game. I, um, I mean, you have to use them at the beginning, but screws are one of the best reasons to go after those hard drives and get those alternate recipes. Yeah, there's so much, like, I don't know, like, little anti-aliasing stuff. I'm going to try setting change here, and I'm going to keep an eye on my rendering and see... if it starts to suffer, but, um, I mean, that's already better. I'm not getting, oh, there's a little bit there. On these little, on these little lines when I run by, yeah, there's a little bit. It's better, though. Okay, we need 500 screws. I'm going to keep messing with my settings, obviously, over time, and we'll get them dialed in, and I'm sure there's going to be some more patches for experimental, um, and we'll figure out the best way to dial these settings in. What I should have done, I should have waited to do my bio break when I was making these screws. That would have been the fix-it way. Come on, 500, baby. All right, those are done. Go check our iron plates. Should be a bunch in here, and there is. And there should be a bunch in there, and there is. Perfecto. Constructed and sent up via the space elevator. Note: Project parts are too complex to produce by hand. Sorry about that. Just checking on something real quick. I'm actually really looking forward to getting started on our platform over there. We just have to get one more thing going, which is need some reinforced plates being automated. Um, and then I think we can start. We definitely have to get the biofuel, the solid biofuel. Five minutes. Yeah, we're not going to wait for that. Um, let's do, I'm going to do a round of gathering. Now, since I turned up the, um, I wonder if this is going to get jumpy now with all this grass, since I made that settings change. Probably doesn't look too bad. I mean, I have a 30, yeah, some encoding. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and just switch it back. I'll, I'll play with this later. I don't want it to be too messed up. Okay. Yeah, those encoding problems looks like they went away once I switched that back to performance.
Okay, I think we're gonna need to make a bunch more screws by hand, unfortunately. This should keep the biomasses burning for a while. Let's grab what we can. Oh, you know what? Halfway there again. That's pretty good. Okay, so we are going to be doing obstacle clearing to get this solid biofuel, and we pretty much have everything, except we need, again, 500. Can we select the milestone yet? We can. Just can't put anything in the box till our pod gets back. Come on, baby. God, screws are the worst. All right. Okay, we're ready to go. Minute and a half. Go refill on concrete. Not much. Not much. One minute. Um, we can prep this out. While we wait. some power and then That even. Hey, it's even. Okay, there we go. Bam, bam. Thank you, ma'am. Here we go. Now we can set this to biofuel. And we can put... Yeah. Alright, we got two little items we have to deal with. Or not deal with, but build. Assembler! So where the constructor is one input and one output, the assembler is two inputs and one output, and that's how we make our reinforced iron plates. Um, but before we do that, we need to get our workshop set up, which I had never done. And our ma'am. Put him over here. Give us a little work area. So we need a chainsaw. Oh my gosh, more screws. But guaranteed there's enough screws over here. So let's just go get those. I think there's like barely enough. <laughs> Come 
Come on. There we go. All right, so now when we go obstacle, or when we go gathering for materials, uh, we'll use the chainsaw. I'm gonna try not to cut down too many of these really nice looking trees, or I will cut down trees, but I'll cut them down farther away from the base. Um, yeah, I'm gonna clear some of those trees because I'm gonna put the space elevator up there. That's probably where I get where, where we will get our first tree clearing going. Um, yeah. Put some more in there. We have enough of these yet to distribute? Not really. How are we doing? We're doing very good. Okay, let's take a quick look at our ma'am. Alien organisms. Let's grab, uh, we put our alien organisms and our power slug away. You coming back? There he is. That's super cool. Research. All right, now we can make um, alien protein and then power slugs. All right. All right, we are gonna need a yellow uh, yellow power select to unlock power shards. And then a blue one to another blue one to unlock the power slugs in our object scanner, which we're not really gonna be doing really all that soon. But we can definitely make this hog protein. Oh, we can actually make a power, we can make a power shard now? No, we can't. Oh, I need another one. All right, well, I'll worry about that later. Uh, we're doing great. We are moving really, really fast. What is next, though, is the question. And what is next is... First of all, let's pick these up. Up. Put the last of our iron ingots in there. And let's put the last of our iron ore in here. Then we'll be able to get rid of this. Um, yeah, I think we need to get an assembler going. Which is gonna be, if I remember correctly, Rotors. Let's grab what screws we can here. Um, actually, let's just make a craft bench and make us some rotors. So, screws and iron plates, yep, 60 per minute, and we're not even making 40, so when we really need to have our first iron, um, reinforced iron plates really be cooking for us. So we need to make an adjustment here. So we need two screws fully. Let's think about this. If I use 15 rods and we go seven and a half, 
75% of 40, which is 30, twice is 60. So that'll work. You just gotta kill this. Yeah, and honestly, these aren't actually getting the full amounts because of this bottleneck here. But help things along like this for now. We gotta get our 120 belts. It's just killing me. Alright. Now. It is time for an assembler. Probably... Honestly... A little bit in the way, but pretty much right here. I can move this. I'm going to move this. that either. Merger. Here's our screws. This should be 60 eventually. And then... How do we orient our assembler? I think we're just gonna go something like... I almost jumped off the edge. There's the screw side. Turn this. All right. Okay, and then we need some power. Tell it to make reinforced iron plates. Now I know this is not super organized. I mean, it, it is kind of like organized chaos a little bit. But, in reality, this is still pretty temporary, relatively speaking. That looks good. There's our reinforced iron plates! All right. We done. We're done with this. We're done with this. We're done with this. 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 And we're done with that. We're done with this.
What do I need for those 120 belts? I am dying. Okay, 50. Yes, these uh, conveyor belt Mark IIs. We're going to skip the jump pads. Nobody wants those anyway. Uh, these, these, the resource sink is really good, and we, and we definitely want that, but we need the Mark IIs first. So, we should have plenty of concrete. And then, honestly, I'm going to basically grab what we can out of the box. Oh, I forgot to set it as a milestone. A little short, but okay. Oh, we have tons of that, uh, tons of screws sitting there ready. And then I'm just gonna craft out the rest of this. No concrete, so we can't build any of those. Just have to be careful not to fall. 11, we're doing really good actually. Let's grab. Craft bench. Make all 16 of these. That should do it. Oh, we're short on iron rods. I'll, um... I mean, no, we have plenty right here. I just didn't throw them in there. We are short on seven concrete, but I'll destroy some foundations if I have to. Concrete. Another one bites the dust. Now the downside with Mark II. The only problem with Mark II is that they need reinforced plates. Trying to make as many as I can real quick. And then we'll go and we'll put uh, all the bottlenecks to Mark II. First one that we're going to fix is going to be the iron. Right here. All right. So much better. Now these belts will be much closer to full. They should be getting the full 30 because we have 120 being split four ways, three ways. Actually, oh uh, yeah, we, um, I, uh, I did my math poorly. You can do one more split. So what do we need? What are we short? You know, honestly, we really should set up one for rotors. Um, need four more rotors.
Yeah. Let's turn that last little piece of iron into a production line. And we'll set up rotors. the rotors oh no I didn't make them <laughs> I made the screws that I need to make the rotors alright okay rotors needs 20 iron rods per minute and a hundred screws per minute so we're not gonna get all of that out of what we need but or out of what we have it'll be close so we're gonna build a splitter here and rods. Come on. Why are we not getting iron ore? Because I forgot to hook that back up. Speaking of concrete, I got distracted. We really, really need to get this Mark II belt in. That will greatly increase our concrete capacity. And then Actually, I don't even think we set up the splitter over here. We did not. Uh, okay, so... It's horrifying. Um, splitter. This might be too tight. That's not gonna work. We gotta turn this. And there. Power. What's our power doing, by the way? Oh my gosh, we're running close, so we gotta, we gotta deal with power.
Okay. That's fixed. That will be going at a nice clip. So I think we could... Yeah, let's get that wire. All right, this should be nice and full. Oh yeah, that's great. So let's double our power. Really, the tree? Stuck in a hole. Off. Okay, so let's get these going. Do hundreds. And then let's replace these with hundred. I saw biofuels. Oh my gosh, it's like I planned it. Then all of our extra biomass, a bunch of it can go in there. I have so much. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. We are doing great. Now, that makes 300 per minute. Okay, that's all backed up, so. Definitely need to, how much does this eat? 120 per minute, perfect. Come on, let me upgrade you. No! Alright, fine. Butter. All Mark twos. working. It did that last time. Oh, I'm an idiot. I need a merger. Dumb. Okay. We're gonna get biofuel all biofuel so much faster now. Do I have any more wood? No, we're out of wood, but that's okay. Okay, so yeah, power's looking good. Uh, what were we doing? We... We're getting our rotor set up. But, uh, this rotor is definitely not going to be 100%. Reinforced arm plates, we're out. But that's okay. We just got to get something going. So.
fortunately, we're really wanted to try to keep this open. Really kind of butting up against my You know what we could do? We could just place him. Then we'll work around him. There are two screws, so it's gonna be a little tight. Um uh, I know what we're gonna do. We're gonna go a little vertical. So Merger. Yep. Splitter. Okay, power. Goose, goose. He doesn't have power yet either. And I guess our slumber is going to go here. Slumber. Where's our stackable splitter? Actually, we don't even need that. Right in line. Right there. That line. See if I can pull this off. One, two. One, two. There. <laughs> uh, you know. No, I can't do it. I can't do it. I'm sorry. Too much. I'll show you what I can do. Or, oh, no, that's not good. Can do this. And then. Save. Yes. Perfect. And now this needs to meander its way. Looks good. Mostly. Um, set this to rotors. Have any leftover power there? No. Do here. Looks terrible. Oh. Terrible. Terrible. I'm gonna go here. Here. 
There. And then a box for our tiny new rotors. Okay. So, yeah, this is not 100% efficient. I get it, but it'll be what it'll be. Looks like another viewer. Um, this will work us until work us just fine until we get sort of the real starter base set up. This is all just actually this is actually a great time to take a look at what we've done. A little recap. Okay, so. In that corner over there, we have uh, the power setup. That's moving. Here's our main ironworks. Four smelters working. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten constructors. Uh, we have uh, iron plates. Here, here, and here. No, here and here, iron plates. And then iron rods are there, 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 and there. And then screws are here and here, and there, and there. These screws are making reinforced iron plates here. And those screws and rod, these screws and plates are making reinforced iron plates. And then these screws and the rods from that one are making rotors there. All off of one Mark I miner uh, in iron on one node. We have three other iron nodes here. So, I mean, there's just there's just not enough space. We, we fully maximized one Mark I miner on one node. <laughs> so, really, the next step, now that these sort of basics are, are automated... And we have some income. We're actually going to start on our next project, which is going to be built out here. So through all of this area, I'm going to expand this platform. And uh, start building there. And I'm going to build, if you're somewhat familiar with satisfactory I, I'm not gonna build this style we've already built this style I'm gonna do something else um, almost like a main bus um, type of instruction so it's uh, it's gonna be good um, and it'll allow us to uh, add on and um, everything else that I am gonna build except for the coal power is going to be built right here everything all the way up until we get mark five belts and then and only then will we start on our actual real factories this is just a starter this is just going to be our, our starter factory and then we will come back through when we need this iron this iron node here we will come back through and delete all this um but i mean that's what, what are we at? We're at two hours and 20 minutes from a fresh start. So we built this in two hours and 20 minutes. Um, this over here is going to take days and days and days to build. So um, we won't need to delete this for quite some time. But uh, yeah, let's get started. I do want to get a little bit of... Yeah, I think this is good. Okay. Um, one thing that we can definitely do, we can advance our resource sink. We have enough materials. Our next milestone. And, oh yeah, look at all that wire. Now, the resource sink is a whole nother thing. Um, I don't really have anything extra right now to start sinking into it. 
basically a recycler. Um, oh, we do not have enough of those two parts. Um, what I like to do is put uh, smart plates in there, but we haven't built any smart plates yet. Um, because we have to build... Two, two of these just might not be enough, honestly. For iron plates. We are, uh... Yeah, this isn't really enough for us. But... We'll have to make do. Bunch of extra iron ore. He's all overflowing. Like they are. Okay. Yeah, we really, unfortunately, need more iron plates. And of course, we need iron plates to build all of the foundations that I need to build. So let's do, um, let's see what we got. All right, we have a little bit of iron on us. Just help out really quickly. Oh, actually, you know what I want to do? I want to make that modular frame. Crap, I don't know how many we need. And go over and open that hard drive. Make ten. No, let's make five. <laughs> oh no, it's not too bad. It's three to make two. I was worried we were gonna eat too much reinforced iron plate. We'll go ahead and make ten. And then let's finish our iron plates. And then I'm gonna drop off. What do we not need? We don't need the flower petals and the hog protein. How are we doing here? Are we finally out? Wow. Biomat. There we go. Uh, which actually means we need to, while we're out, check out our new chainsaw. All right, let's, uh, I don't want to get rid of too, too much, but, um, we can kind of clear the way for a future road through here, I think. So if you, uh, if you don't know, if you gather, like if you gather these plants, they grow back, but if you use the chainsaw on them, they do not. And they kind of work in an area of effect here. So I figure we'll probably put a road in here at some point. And then the fuel for this is biofuel. So, solid biofuel. Um, I wonder if I can get here and leave that tree behind me. Nope, it took the tree. Oh, well. There is a way to, um, if you fill up your inventory, um, it doesn't do this AOE, like, effect. It only cuts down the thing you're actually trying to cut down. Um, which, if I really cared about that tree, like if I was including it in a in a build, that's what I would have done.
Yeah, see, I don't want to cut that guy down. So, I'm going to probably leave most of this. Far enough away. Um, where was our hard drive? Those uh, hogs might be back, so. Oh, actually, I have two slots now. Yay! Bird. Poison penises. I didn't make that name up. What they're called. Um. Alright, there's a hog. There's our base. There's the copper portion of our base. There's That's what we're looking for right down there. Okay. Oh, we only need one. Perfect. Hard drive. And then if you don't know what hard drives are, the hard drive has been salvaged and can be repurposed to unlock an alternate recipe. Salvaging more hard drives will provide additional alternate recipes. So yes, uh, I didn't want to be I want to interrupt Ava. Um but yeah, we uh Use it to unlock recipes. Oh, that tree got eight. So it's a 10 minute research. So I just built the mam really quick and uh, threw it in there. Oh, that big tree got eaten. Oh well, I'm over it. This is the Empire's uh, theme playthrough, so, um, you know, lateral damage is uh, gonna happen. All right, check on our power. 60, cool, so we put in 100 each and it's only down to 60. What do we have in here? Lots. So let's keep going on that. We're safe for now. Get these flower petals put away. Nope. Be it shift click, it will unload everything. So. All right, that was great. This is really bugging me, so I'm going to fix this. Hopefully we've saved up enough... Not really. Problem is we're um see how much we're we using. Yeah, we're using thirty. And we're producing sixty, so we're using half of it. But I don't wanna Yeah, I don't wanna do anything else than that right now. That's okay. It'll be one of the first things we build on our new in our new base setup. I mean, we really need that other. Um, to be honest with you, I wonder if I could. Ah, I can't take this out. Do I have enough? I have exactly a hundred there. We're actually going to get started on the um, on the platforms. I'm uh, done waiting. Because we don't we don't really need that awesome sink because we don't have anything sink. So we are gonna make a lot of space. Um might not be able to afford to build all that right now.
show you what I have in mind here. Oh, we're already, we're already spent. That's fine. So we're we're gonna. I want two empty rows so that we have space in the future. And so we're actually gonna start our construction here. The last thing that gets constructed is on the end is actually a merger. Okay, but where is the start of it? I think should be enough space. I think we can. I think we can start here. So two in, and then we'll start right in the middle. In the, in the center, but on this side. I'm out of concrete and iron plates. That lone merger is the first to be placed of our new, of our large starter factory that I'm going to be working on for weeks. It's going to progress most of our gameplay, actually, is this starter factory. We're going to build a mega starter factory. And it's going to be awesome. Now, I have to have enough space here. Can't remember exactly how much. So we're going to test. That is enough. That will... That'll work. Okay, so we've got that placed. Go ahead and leave that. Um, actually, let's leave them all. That's correct. Yep. Nope, that one's not. There we go. Okay, those are correct. Now... Oh, actually, the first one isn't... Um, the first row is actually not a constructor, so... First row is actually smelters. That's a little tighter than the other one. Um, I think this works as long as... Backwards. As long as that works, we'll be fine. Yep, and that works. Of course, this works fine. So yeah, this was this is this is our spacing right here. Technically we can fit another a whole nother splitter in there. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Now we need to do the same thing with a splitter. Here. No, I think I'm just gonna bang this one right down the middle because we were basically there anyway. Here's our splitter. Yes, yes. We're out of iron plates. The first thing we build over here is gonna be iron plates. <laughs> Yeah, so that's a little wider than this one. But I'm okay with it. We'll just match it on the other side. Where is he? Right on the lines. Right there. Make sure this looks even. Yep, looks great. And then we gotta do the same um, that we did. Oh my god, I, I swear, I will fall off of this thing. I'm like, deathly afraid of falling off this thing. Until I get my jackpot. 
I want to see how long I can go without dying. Of course, I say that and I'm going to fucking die, like, really quick. Alright, uh, I think we were here. Yep. Yeah. Right on the edge. Right on the edge. Perfect. So, one, two, three, four, five tiles worth for one row. So, we're going to have a smelter row. Where we just send the raw materials straight down the middle. It gets split off of each side. So the raw materials come down the middle. It gets split into the smelters on each side. And then they get sent back up through the mergers back towards us. And these bad boys go up as high as you want. Almost. Look how high that goes. And actually, you can get it higher than that even um, if you use a floor hole plate, which we would definitely do. So we can make this stack as high as we want and we just load them in. Um, and we can also increase the belts. So we only have 120 per minute belts right now, but you know, we'll get 480 or 320 or no, 270 and then 480, right? And so we can just increase the belts and then put more smelters on the back end. Um, and then increase the belts coming back and it just loads up the completed materials. Oh, the mam's done. See if we get lucky. So that's the plan. Um, wow. This is huge. This is awesome. This is so awesome. I can change, completely change my... My setup. I don't need nearly as many screws. I will need some screws for rotors. But I can make... Now I can make plates without... Oh, uh, it's amazing. I will have to get copper over here. But I, I'm so happy. That was such a good pull. That's why we do those is so that we don't have to deal with as many screws. Um, so yeah, let's look at that. And then I'm going to make, I'm just going to make these one twenties. Honestly, we don't have the copper, um, or not the copper. We don't have the regular plates anyway to do the Mark one belts. I'm just going to make everything Mark two, which means it's time to officially change my quick buttons over from Mark one down here. Number three is bringing up a Mark one and I'm going to change it over to Mark two to change these. By the way, you just hit the button that you want them to be lifts uh, lifts. We're going to stick with Mark one. We're definitely going to stick with Mark one because on the way out or on the way in each that they, they very few will actually need a mark two off of the split like this but the actual majority of this construction we're gonna do a mark two so let's try to stay nice and organized let's see one two I don't know why I'm having such a hard time. We really need to build this guy. Nope, he's not straight. He is, though. Excited to build this. I've been planning this and actually got this idea from I think Stin Archie. 
on YouTube. That's where this idea came from. To do this sort of like main bus style. How's our power doing? We're okay. Got a ways to go. So to make things easier, I'm just going to build off of this side for now. Um, I'm also, I, I will build an underfloor to this to move some of these uh, materials around. Um, but for now, uh, let's see, we got 120, so four of them, correct? So all four of these are going to be based off of this bottom. And we're just going to build ourselves some splitters. Mark ones to go to feed into the actual and then mark twos down the central pipeline. Now this is a um, this is a manifold style. I'm a believer in manifold. There's a loading. I can't remember what it's called. The name is escaping me. But basically, uh, you pre-split them so they go in evenly, like I did over there. Uh, but the manifold is faster, simpler, and uh, it takes a lot less space. The only downside is is that it takes a while to get up to full production uh, because they have to, uh, you know, machines have to fill up. So there's a downside, but uh, it's this is a marathon kind of game, so I don't think spending a little time is really that big of a deal. Out of iron plates. We don't really need these. And Mark Two's coming up. And here's where all of our iron ingots are going to come out. Iron plates, baby. Um, so, yeah, we're going to have a row of smelters, obviously, both... Uh, and then eventually we're gonna put our foundries here as well on this on on the back end. Um, you know, iron, lots and lots of iron. Um, probably all of our copper smelting will go on that side. Um, and then um, and then obviously there are steel. Uh, and then we're gonna have a huge row of constructors. Here, let me pull up my plans real quick. Um, let's see. Here's my setup. I got it all. Actually, it's going to be different now. I'll have to, um, I have to change it because we got lucky and we don't have to build so many screws. So it's going to be really, really, it's going to be a lot easier actually. Uh, but right now, currently, if we didn't get that, um, we would need uh, 130 constructors total, 48 assemblies, 26 foundries, 89 refineries. The refineries, we're going to have a row just for refineries as well. So we're going to have a constructor row, an assembler row, a refinery row, um, and 12 manufacturers. That'll go on the assembly row. Um, yeah, this is going to go way into that close to, close to that mountain. Hopefully not all the way there. Uh, okay, now we need to start our, our um, 
trucker row. And then again, I'm gonna have one space here for walkways. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna need any belts there. If I do need belts there, I'll put them in the subfloor. And then centered. Yeah. And now a constructor. First of many. That green line. Wrong green line, I think. I got him so close to the edge. I'm trying to like save um the uh smart plates, but at the same time uh not build so little platform that I fall off the edge. Is that correct? Am I going insane? Backwards, dummy. I wasn't getting the green line I needed. So that's not as tight as that other one, and I want to make a match, so we need to go one closer. That was there. Let's there. Yep. That works, and let's just double check. Come on, will you get in there? Not. Ah. Did I build it backwards again? I did! <sighs> it's late. There we go. Um, and now a splitter. And then I think we decided we were going to go right in the middle. Okay, that works. Probably go the other way. Yeah, like this. So it doesn't clip right here. But we'll do that when the time comes. Leave those for now, actually. Um, only need to mark one here. Mark two is going to come out. Okay, time to go get more plates. This is why we're building plates first. So I didn't kill myself. Um, you know what? I really hate this, so I'm gonna change it. I want everything to come down the middle. We'll run this down here. And then at the last second, we'll do a wiggly. That work? Nope. Perfect. Okay, I like that better. And now I can match that here. Now these are probably actually the lines that I'm gonna stick under the No, 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 no. Yes. Um, and the reason is... Is because I'm gonna have... Something coming out of here. Probably iron rods. Right? And so... I don't know. We'll, we'll have to see. I might be able to make keep it organized. But these... 
this area is it's taking up too much area really to keep these belts organized these are most likely what's going to go um under the flooring um when that time comes okay this goes here this goes here and yeah mark two comes out and then we actually need Yeah, so this is what I'm talking about. These plates are gonna come out and then they've gotta go over to our assembler row. So it's gonna be a bit of a mess. Um, but I can handle it for now. We're gonna go there, there, and then you should be able to turn and go up, no? Oh, wow, you did not like that. Figure out something that looks nice. Does not look nice. I'm trying to both turn, go up. Instead, let's go up first. That's what we're going to have to do. Go up here. Here, here. Two or I think it's three actually. Yep. There we go. Now we can turn. Okay, so here's where the plates will come out. Okay. Where did we start? Right on the line. Check. The line. Right on the line. Okay. Then our merger comes out. Seems like a lot of space. That's, that is not right. Going insane. Um, that doesn't match. The tighter gap is here. So, I gotta move this. First one's super important. If I mess up the first one, they're all gonna be messed up. So, I was here. Want to be... Oh, autosave. Suck. I was here. There. <laughs> what is the problem? That's in the middle. Oh, it's probably something stupid like the fact that it's it's, I know what, the constructors are not the same length as the, constructors are not the same length as the smelters, so, throwing me off. And, you know, we're out of iron plates. Um, but yeah, this should work. Except I built that off. OK. 
Okay. Um, and now we start our space for. Oh God, Iron Plate. You know what? Let's build. Um, let's get the Iron Plates going. I think I still need them. Before we worried about. Before we worry about the. Um, Assembler row. Let's see, we have four smelters in place. So, and if I remember right, yeah, they're thirty thirty. That means we can get four. Oh my god. I'm having like vertigo because I think I'm gonna fall off of this damn thing. I just realized we haven't touched power in forever. So, yeah. Do that trick. Sad. Just split, just split it. Filters are a little thinner than um. Um. Let's do it off the back end. Oh, down to one viewer. Thank you, whoever you are. I appreciate you. Uh, I knew, I knew the power was close. Because if you weren't here, I would really be talking to myself. Now I can pretend that I'm not. You know, what I have to do is, um, I have to assume that people are going to watch this pod, and I'm talking to them. I think that that is the way that it works. All right, how's our power? Okay, doing great. Okay, I need 
just a minute. Oh, we're so close over here to get this rolling. It's gonna look really nice when it when it goes. I'm really looking forward to the setup. I just need just a minute for a buyout, not long. Okay, I'm back. Oh, we're back to two viewers. Welcome. Second viewer. If you weren't here before. Or welcome back if you were. Oh, back down to one. Sad. He didn't, he didn't like it here. He probably actually showed up when I was on the bio break. That's probably what happened. All right, where were we? We were dealing with power with smelters. Um, yeah, I think we'll just go kind of here. Problem is I don't, hard to see. I wanna keep them even. Giving smelters power is always a pain. Oh, I just gotta go. I just gotta go with that line there. Yeah, that should work. Okay. Come on. And one more down here. One's off. Thought it was there. I don't even know, honestly, but it's close enough. Close enough for fix it work. Actually, it's close enough for starter base work. Okay. Um, no power still. I'm gonna cut this one because. Place it. Um, we're gonna need power. Yeah. Not there. Let's see. And then I think we'll come down to here. And then, I don't know, God knows where from there. Here, I guess. There, there. 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 And they're on. There we go. And those are gonna come around, those are gonna feed into here. Uh, I've got these built, but I've got to build that so I don't fall. That breeze is nice, having the door open. And we're missing iron plates, because forever we were constantly missing concrete, and now it's iron plates turn. How sometimes the green line doesn't show up. Yep. 
Is that four? One, two, three, four. Yes. They all set to iron plates. No. Copy. Paste. And there's iron plates. Um, we have room for a. That's the other reason that I wanted this big space over here is. I'm gonna need room for the storages. Like a good, permanent storage. Um, I think this is just gonna be something temporary. Is that, is that right? <laughs> uh, it doesn't fit. Of course it doesn't fit. Why would you fit? What are we gonna do? Something temporary, jeez. Um... Alright, I know what we're gonna do. same problem. <sighs> Floating storage? Okay, floating storage it is. Wow. That is... Alright, we're gonna rebuild it so we don't have those feet. save. Okay. No feet. And finally... Now we are really cooking with our wonderful iron plates. Should not have an iron plate problem anymore. Okay. Now we have to start really hitting the reinforced plates hard. And the reason is, let's get some. rotors and the reason is because we need to make we need to get smart plate going and I want how much smart plate here total um, assemblers we're gonna want huh 
All right, yeah, just one smart plate. So that's good. I guess one is all you need. Um, and the smart plate, once we get the 50, the smart plate is going to feed our... Um, Trash compactor. Just gotta messed up my windows looking at my. All right, there we go. Back to two concurrent viewers. Hello, second viewer. Or if you're the same viewer coming back, welcome back. Uh, okay. Reinforced plates and then smart plate. Now, because we got that special recipe, we um, don't need to make quite so many screws, which is going to be great. Oh, yeah, look at that. Um, but the downside is we need to move the copper over. So... It's going to run right along here. I think what I'll do is reserve the first four. For iron, because we have four iron nodes. And then that one will be copper. So... Um, and it needs to be Mark II. It's gonna be ex an expensive boy. And that's not gonna be enough. We're gonna need to... He's so tall. Stackable. Come on, baby. That. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. I'm sure that this. Wait. Yep. This is going to be our copper highway. There. Oh, no, no. These guys. One, two, three, four, five. No, 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 no. Come on. You, you should work. Work. Yes! That's like max distance right there. <sighs> Maximum effort. Here. One. Five. We're burning through our reinforced iron plate like crazy people. Um, let's build a ramp. Two ramps. Production. Mark one minor. Yep, that will work perfectly. Is that straight? Ah, no. So I'm just gonna I'm not gonna sh kill this quite yet but I'm gonna get it ready and then I'll come and delete all of this spaghetti monster over here for our, uh, our copper and our wire until we can Recreate it over there, and then it'll all be set up. Is that? Um, okay. 
Going insane? This should just be four, maybe? I need a, I need a tower. And I appreciate the likes also, um, you guys. That is definitely an incline there. That first one's an incline too. I bet you I only need four. I cannot see this very well. Try going out to our... Yeah, that's an incline there. Okay. That's much better, which makes sense uh, because you build one to get you to the second level. Duh. I got scared. I thought I fell. Don't incline. Best of its miracle. There it is. And then, as soon as it's ready. Yep. We'll hook it up. In the meantime, he's gonna keep on keeping on. And then, I think there's another copper mine over there, so when the time comes, we'll just stack another one on top and Run it down. Now, I think what we're gonna do is uh, make this side copper. Um, I actually, oh, you know what? I don't know how many coppers because again, we're changing recipes, but um, I'm fine. I'll go with the flow. So, four to start, right? Because 120 coming out. Make sure copper eats 30. It does. So, yeah. Four to start. And four is enough. So ugly, we're not doing that. We have to do that one and that one, that one and that one. Good, 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 good. Yep, very yellow. <sighs> okay. Now the beauty of the setup. Four. 
More? Alright. Kill these. Nope. Need the bottom one. Come on. Kill those. 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 Let me go. Boom. Boom. What the hell? Boom. Then, arc one. Then, arc one. Mergers. Okay. There's copper ingots. So what did we do over there? We did this. One, two. Three. Let me look again. No, he had to go down a lot. I mean, he didn't have to, I guess. I mean, it actually would be a lot nicer if he was there at work. Yeah. Doing that. Well, that is the t then one. Constructors. This is where our plates are coming out. Um, so we'll do constructors on the other side here. For wire and yeah, wire. Then we will have to feed some wire back down this to get the cable. Um, but how much wire are we making? Um, yeah, this is wrong. Yeah. Actually, no, let's continue our... Fifteen. So, <laughs> we have 120 coming out. Um... So that would be... What, eight? We don't need eight. I think copper sheets. Let me tab out real quick and just see if copper sheets. Uh, take. Um, yeah, they take copper ingots. 20. So let's see, we have 120 coming in. We're going to need two constructors of copper sheets at least. So just trying to plan ahead here. That leaves us 80. Oh, it's getting dark. Um, Actually, it's not that dark. Uh, that leaves us 80 per minute. 80 divided by 15 is unfortunately not a round number. Kind of sucks. Uh, let's say we did three. That would leave us... Yeah, that works. Three. Um, yeah, we'll just cut it in half. 120 goes to copper sheets. So, four. This works. 
One, two, three, four. Definitely gonna have to stack around our stupid floating box. Dumb. I'll fix it later. Do. Go ahead and just kill this so it's out of the way. And then this. Okay, so this actually needs to go there, not... Again, we're going to clean up this sort of area with... You know what? Copper's going to be that high. We're just going to make copper that high. Silly not to. Let's kill it in the... Get its height right here. One time. Iron plates. Okay. I actually haven't had a chance to really play with the um, the new buttons for deleting in Update 8. I'll uh, probably do that, maybe, when I'm not streaming. Get comfortable with them. Probably reset the... Uh, and I also got to get that auto save to 10 minutes instead of 5. That's really kicking my ass. Alright, and then, honestly, we definitely don't need... Definitely don't need this one. We'll keep that one. You gonna make it? <laughs> of course you're not. Um, right here we'll need them. One, two, four. Straight. Looks beautiful. Uh, let's leave those. Let's not leave the... Four. One, two, four. I'm gonna connect to first. Here. Yeah.
Okay, I like it. Actually, a little room to run through there if I really need to as well. Um, okay, now these are going to be set to... Yeah, wire. We don't have any power. So, I think we can just run through here. Place our power here. There. 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 Speaking of power. Dirty word. Did my power fail and I... No, it's not connected. I'm an idiot. There we go. Okay, we're still doing okay. Uh, but... I don't think my... May, we may have to go gathering here pretty soon. Okay, what is the holdup? Oh, we haven't turned it on. That's right. Okay, let's get the wire back out now. Oh my goodness. I am going to fall off that damn thing. So much done today. Uh, it's really dark. Really? Out of iron plates. I mean, reinforced iron plates. Which are over here in this box. Daytime. I can turn my light off. Well, we can definitely go uh, into the uh, awesome sink milestone. <laughs> we fixed our iron plate problem, boys. That is level one, level one, level one. Some of our reinforced plates back. Okay, so here's our wire. Um, I'm not too worried about cable for now. We will need to kick some of this wire back into one of these. Probably, I don't know, maybe this one. Did we do that? No, probably not. Probably through there. So, and then we would need to build... Um, a few cables off the end here. But I'm really trying to get smart plating rolling because that is our next real big holdup for both the space elevator as well as um, the reason that I can't build the underfloor is because I don't have floor holes, which you need awesome shot points for. And I mean, I could throw, I guess I could throw. Yeah, I I could do it, but I guess I don't want to. <laughs> Merger, skip this. And now we're going to build our first assembler on the line here. So, yeah. 
Let's see. Here. Hmm. You know, I'm not gonna... That should be somewhere on this line. But I'd rather have the assembler line up this crack here. At the correct distance. It's gonna be there. Probably there. Nope, that's too that's too little. Actually, how big? All right, so this line, I'm going to need to put manufacturers on at the end. And so what I don't want to do is eat into my... So really, I have to do the width for a manufacturer between this line and the input. So what I need to do, I'm just gonna tab out real quick and I'm gonna look at the size of an assembler, the length. Okay, so the length of an assembler is 15 meters, okay? And now we're gonna look at the length for a manufacturer. And all I'm doing is uh, on the satisfactory wiki, length for a manufacturer is 20 meters so it's an extra five meters now the good news is is that um wish i had um painted beams because then i could measure it so this is four that's two no it's eight that's four sorry i'm saying here so it's eight wide it's eight long so this is four we need We could do the hookup in three. That's three. We could do the hookup in three. Well, we just need 20. So, no, what we need is four more than the assembler. That's what we need. So if the assembler can go Let's say we weren't putting it on there. The assembler would go here. Yep, and that would work. But we need four more, which is a whole nother half. We could do one more. Let's put this one down. There's one, two, three, four. Okay. I think I like this. Because then we can do hope. Splitter right in the middle. That's going to be too tight. That is super lame. Hope if I lined it up. I don't think it matters. I mean, we could make it work, but... the minimum make that work all right what if we just do a little bit wider space and get this to the next no because that's gonna look like shit that works
Maybe that's not the minimum. So we can move this. I think it is though. We could gain one by moving this this way. What would that be? That would. Come on. Even one closer. How does this look? No, it's the same problem. I swear there's a way. Oh, I know what it is. It's a floor hole. I can actually make this work. I can make this work with a floor hole. And 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 have zero difference there. So that's that's what we're gonna do. We don't need to do it with the assembler. We'll do it with the um manufacturer though. So <laughs> okay. So we're gonna move this assembler where he goes. Should be minimum distance, maximum effort. Yes. Okay, so this is where the assemblers are gonna go and where the, the front of the manufacturers, and then the back of the manufacturers, I should, because there are four more, there are four more, just make sure. One, two, three, four. Yeah, I think I can make that work with floor, with floor holes. If not, well, um, I'll deal with it later. Um, and then also, these are effing backwards. So that's great. Things these are wrong. Okay, that was fun, but um, I think we will have saved ourselves a whole hell of a lot of trouble, and I think we can still we can still make this happen the way we want. Also, what's really gonna fry your noodle is, oh, I don't need that, is that um, we can actually stack these. We can do two floors of assemblers. We can do f three or four floors of constructors. I can't remember. And there's enough room for the lifts. So that's going to be really fun. And we can do two floors of manufacturers when the time comes. All right, we're definitely making... Oh, no, we're making the alternate recipe. I cannot believe our first alternate recipe is one that eliminates screws. I fucking love it. It's amazing. Speaking of which, how many of these are we going to have? Wire... That's a lot of wire. Um, I think two going to be perfectly fine for us. Going to be our new iron plates. All right, let's get the splitters in place. Here. Here, here.
Really? Did I mess this one up too? Yes. What is the problem? Oh, it's this one that's messed up. In late. There we go. Okay, and just need to mark ones for here and here. Power as well. Power. It's here. Putting our powers on the outside. Yeah, kind of. Let's just do it. That'll be fine. There, and here. You are all the way down here. It's one o'clock. Uh, I am trying to do four hour streams. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get our reinforced plates done and then I will call it. Uh, I won't do, no. No, because smart plates need rotors. So I'd have to set the whole, I'd have to set rotors up down here. So we're not gonna do that tonight. We're just gonna get these reinforced plates done. Um yeah. So we need wire here or there, and iron plates in the other place. Where's our wire coming out? Wire's coming out. Here. We're going this tile two. Thought that was off. We we'll definitely put wire on the bottom. Super convenient. Barely an inconvenience. And then we will definitely put iron plates on the second row. Because he's just begging to be in the second row. Here. Iron plates are moving. Um, all right, all I want to do is set up What are we gonna do what are we gonna do we we're gonna need reinforced plates so We're gonna have to do another floating box But we're gonna have to make him up here Can I jump that yes So he's a higher floating. Oh, my music. Let me 
restart that bad boy. But I figure I started the stream late, so we can, you know, we, we can end it late. There we go, music's back. Tell you what, um, I've never needed a third screen until I started stream streaming. One all the way to the ground. Bar. Okay, so that is the reinforced plates. And then now these reinforced plates will be ready to go down the third row. Well, let's just build it real quick. Take long. And the third row is going to be for our lovely um, bar plating, which I think needs reinforced plates and rotors off the top of my head. Um, and then the rotors, what we'll do is we'll make them off side here yeah we're out so that's fine I'll do it later but um, we'll make them off the side over here and then feed them around this way just like we are with the reinforced iron plates and they will feed into that one and then we'll make uh, a smart plate. Probably over here on this side, because we're going to need more um, reinforced iron plates. So we'll make the smart plate over here. Then that will come around, and we will finally have our smart plate done. So that won't take very long at all next time. Uh, and by the way, I'm going to be streaming Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays. So um, two days. And then I'll be cutting a short version of this video and I'll upload that as soon as I can probably won't be tomorrow it'll probably be Thursday morning um so yeah if you see that give that a like for me um you will already have watched the content but I appreciate it um yeah so the only thing left to do now before we call it a night is switch our Now we have enough concrete. Uh, is switch our um, copper ore, and then watch it all come together. So I'm gonna race down here and build ourselves a tower to watch it happen. Come on, got to be faster than the Mark II belt. Auto save. So we're gonna build one here. And we're gonna build one here. And we're gonna build one here. Come on, I gotta hurry. It's coming, I can see it. This one's actually pretty far. We're gonna build them a little closer. There it comes. All right, so I think everything's all set. We're gonna come down. Oh, that we have a little uh, T junction there. <laughs> we'll deal with that. Uh, again, I'm gonna end up hiding most of these lateral um, inputs. For sure, the outputs, uh, like where this wire is gonna come through. Or this, these ingots. Um, I'm going to hide them. So, underneath. But yeah, we should come in here, drop down, smelt, come back up into ingots, come back through ourselves, and then head over there to be turned into wire. So, alright, there we go. We're moving down the belt. Now, again, because this is a manifold setup, it's going to take some time for all of those... Uh, this first smelter has to overflow completely before the next one can really be efficient. 
So this line eventually will be packed full. We have exactly 120, but it's going to be a little stuttery um, until then. Um, in fact, actually, do I have any? I do. Check this out. We're gonna we're gonna cheat a little. We're gonna miss our copper, but it's kind of worth it actually. Throw this in. We're gonna come on, come on, come on. There we go. That'll speed things up. All right, let's run down to our next wire production. Turning our ingots into wire. Yeah. There we go. There's our first wire. Going to come out the door. Head down and go in the first ra round for the... special recipe plates. So that's looking good. And again, that's going to have the same problem. It's going to take a while for that first one to fill up. Oh, we have a little uh, going on there. the funky's happening there. That's okay. I'll, I'll look at it in a second. Um, yeah. No, it's okay. It was just like a... Oh, no, it's off. I see. I'll fix that in a second. Wire's going in. We're not getting any iron plates. Why are we not getting any iron plates? Did I not connect this? Oh, I did. Splitter. That's a splitter. It should go straight through. It's like a bad connection or something. Oh, it's going so fast, I probably missed. There we go. And then we should be getting our first iron plates from the other one. Working? Working. It's working! Here we go. Reinforced iron plates. And then let me actually fix this real fast. Oh, how I messed this up. I really need my um, roller blades. Oh my god. And there's an auto save. Great. Okay. Come on, buddy. Right down the middle. this. Two. Well, it wasn't a perfect launch, but it was pretty close. Had this stupid, uh... ...thing be unlined. Not correctly aligned. There we go. Not setting off my OCD quite so badly. Um, yeah.
And then that's actually going to store up iron plates um, for later use. Then um, the extra will get stored uh, here in the uh, perch, which is perfect. The ones that we actually are using is fine. We'll, we'll still pull them from there. So yeah, I think we're all done here. Um, I'm going to, the only thing I'm going to do is um, go and delete everything over here. Um, except the storage bins. I'll move these storage bins a little later. But all of this... Um, actually, you know what? It's dumb. Um, these have these have a backlog, so I'm just gonna let these... I'm gonna let these, uh... their thing. Sorry. Mess with your... your groove. Cable and power on you. Yeah, so we have this big old backlog. So I'll just let that completely do its thing. All right, I think that's going to be it, guys. Thanks for watching. Um, uh, you know, I'm not super experienced with streaming, so the stream's a little unorganized. The, uh, the building is organized, but... My order of operations a little scattered. But uh, I'll get better. I'll get better with time. But for what we... Uh, for four hours, four hours plus a little bit, I am seriously proud of what we got done. It's nice and clean. Um, and then um, I am going to work on hiding a lot of this once we get smart plates up and running and our floor holes are in. Um... I'm also going to get uh, walkways pretty quick. So, yeah. I know we didn't get to see a lot of Lumen or a lot of the uh, new features from Update 8 yet. I mean, we are seeing Lumen. It's on. Um, but we're not really seeing the effects of it too much outdoors. Um, we're going to really see that indoors when we cover this in, like, a big hangar or something. Um, and we'll definitely see it uh, when we're on our uh, subfloor. So... All right. Well, thanks again. Appreciate it. Hope to see you guys again um, Thursday night, same time. And that is it for me. Thanks a lot.